first citizen is Mr. Burton Fletcher. Please come forward and state your name and address for the record, please. Thank you, esteemed commissioners and staff. Burton Fletcher, 3533 Cherry Creek Road, Valdosta, Georgia, 31605. I have rather lighthearted comments uh, this evening. Uh, wish to make some heartfelt congratulations in my remarks. First, I'd like to applaud Michael Smith's election to the board. His knowledge and fresh ideas promise to contribute constructive considerations to our ongoing uh, deliberations. I'd like to wish and convey my best wishes to Commissioner Greiner. Uh, it's worth noting that Abraham Lincoln faced several failures before his eventual success as president. Uh, thus, I encourage you to remain committed to serving our community. And we certainly have a lot of openings in animal rescue for you. So please keep that in mind, if you will. I congratulate Assemblyman Dexter Sharper on his recent victory, his continued uh, advocacy for individuals experiencing homelessness and those in need is most commendable and necessary. Uh, I congratulate uh, Chairman Slaughter uh, on an impressive re-election to a fourth term. Reflecting on Lincoln's legacy, it is inspiring to remember how Lincoln included talented rivals in his cabinet, fostering collaboration and progress. Moreover, I would like to highlight Kelly Saxon as an exceptional community leader. Her impressive community support demonstrated by 17,453 votes speaks volumes about her capability and our community's trust in her. I have not informed her that I would be making these remarks this evening. I would just say that let's keep in mind what President Lincoln did and by bringing in his opponents, he was quite successful uh, in his term of office. Next, I would like to acknowledge Ms. Jessica Gaines at the historic Lowndes County Courthouse. She is remarkable. She gave me a tour recently, uh, and uh, along with uh, Jessica Culpepper, and it was an excellent tour. For anybody who have not taken that tour, I encourage them to do so. Uh, I think Ms. Gaines represents the very best of public service, so my hat's off to her. Uh, she just did a great job, and when she gave her presentation, to the uh, uh, group of attorneys uh, the other uh, week on Thursday and Friday, or I guess her comments were on Thursday, I believe. Uh, it was uh, very informative. In fact, that case that she brought forward, I think uh, is something we ought to consider uh, memorializing in our county uh, in some significant way about the 1905 hanging that occurred in our community. I think. Uh, that's the case that we ought to consider. Uh, some people may consider, uh, criticize the uh, amount of money that was spent on the rehabilitation of the historic courthouse. I believe that's going to go down as a hallmark of your service, and I believe ultimately the public will recognize that as a success that I believe it to be. Finally, um, Veterans Day at Lowndes High School Chairman Slaughter and Commissioner DeMarcus spoke there. It was a wonderful event, and I thank you for your participation, and I would encourage everyone to attend in the future. It was just a remarkable event. I now understand why my property taxes on the portion of schools is so high. Uh, and finally, I'd like to ingest, uh, thank Dr. Uh, DeMarcus Marshall for his service as a Marine, so I tease him about his decision to abandon that path for the U.S. Army. Uh, regardless, he remind, remains one of my Marine brothers, and I look forward to connecting with him at the American Legion and throughout our vibrant community. He's a very fine uh, fellow. So I thank all of you. I, I gave all of you a challenge point this evening, uh, reflecting on Veterans Day yesterday and my own service many years ago. I can't believe it. it's like 54 years ago. But I thank all of you. Yesterday was a very 